took a pill in Ibiza to show Avicii I was cool. And when I finally got sober. Hey guys, it's Brandy, and I'm going to be reacting to babysitting stories. Also, I will link his channel up in the eye, so go subscribe to him. Also, I'll link the original video up there as well. And yeah, let's, so let's just hop into this. Let's just get started. It was during a blizzard in Valley Stream. I was getting paid $250 to watch some couple's kid while they went away for the weekend. His name was Matthew. This took place on the first night, which was a Friday night. Matthew was already supposedly asleep while I was in the living room watching a movie. I got a knock at the door. Okay, that is the worst scenario ever. Oh goodness, my heart is beating so fast. Close to midnight. There was no way I was opening it. Not even 10 seconds later, I heard the sound of two or three men angrily banging on the door, telling me to open up. I felt like my heart was about to stop. I took a peek through the blinds, and there was somebody standing right on the other side of the window. I fell back in fear, and after managing to get back on my feet, I ran to the kitchen phone first thing to call the police. They said because of the weather, it could take a while for an officer to get here. I was told to take the child and hide somewhere until an officer arrived. They wanted to keep me on the line, but I wasn't thinking clearly in the heat of the moment and hung up. However, it wasn't until I ran through the living room that I realized the banging had stopped. I took a second peek through the living room window. Nobody was there now. I heard the sound of glass shattering from a few rooms over. My oh my goodness. That's like the worst noise anyone could probably hear. That's awful. My knees started to feel weak as I realized they had just broken the window and were about to climb into the house. I had to run and get Matthew. I couldn't just leave without him. Of course, when I got upstairs, there was no time left to run back downstairs as I already heard footsteps and laughter coming from downstairs. I covered Matthew's mouth with my hands as I ran with him into his toy closet. A few minutes dragged on to what felt like half an hour as we sat there in the dark closet. Matthew began to squeal as footsteps on the carpet reached the outside of his bedroom door. There was more than one person. They came inside. There weren't many places to hide. Then if there's one more than one person, you can definitely not fight them back. Like that's what would they want with him though? What what did they ever do? In this room. I was actually reflecting on my whole life, so sure I was gonna die. We heard the sound of a police siren outside, even from in the closet. And then I heard one of the men in the room mutter, Oh shit. Oh, I opened the door back up as I heard at least three pairs of footsteps hurriedly rushing down the stairs. They didn't get far as the police later found their footprints in the backyard, leading to our shed. There were five men in total, and they were all arrested. Goodness, they look so scary. That is awful. Oh my goodness, guys, so that could actually happen. So you need to lock the doors, you need to lock the windows, you need to make sure you're safe, and you need to be very responsible and make sure to call the cops immediately. Yeah. And definitely hide. Don't fight back because then that something worse. They could run off with Matthew if they wanted if you just fought back. You need to hide somewhere that they wouldn't think to find you. I would probably hide in my basement or my closet or like a small space, linen closet or somewhere that's safe. So hope you guys like this week's video. Come comment down below if you know this YouTuber and like this video for more videos like this. And I hope I, you like the whole setup of this. I just want to try something different. So yeah, and please, 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 please tell your friends, family, uncles, dads. To subscribe because eight more subscribers and then I get to a hundred subscribers that would mean the world to me so yeah 
Hope you guys like the video and see you guys next week. I love you, love you, love you, love you so, so much. Bye. To go over everything.